sponsored by Catchpoint, the leader in digital experience management. Hi, I'm Chris Lopez, technical marketing engineer for Catchpoint. Today, we're going to go over how to monitor split tunnel traffic with Catchpoint. One thing people figured out pretty quickly when we transitioned to a remote workforce was that there are some applications that should not be pushed through the corporate VPN. Video and voice applications like Microsoft Teams are basically essential to continued business operations, and I wouldn't want to add another point of failure I'd need to troubleshoot if I didn't have to. One easy way to get around that is to split tunnel the traffic, which is to say exclude certain traffic from your VPN. Split tunneling helps conserve bandwidth while still enabling unfettered access to local resources. It's a great solution for multiple use cases like people living overseas or people who need access to sensitive data while still having a performance requirement. One issue that comes with this, however, is that when people use endpoint clients and VPNs to define their business perimeter, corporate IT starts to lose visibility. Traffic that's being pushed through an employee split tunnel device is inherently riskier than traffic that is simply going through a VPN. And this doesn't just include visiting forbidden sites, it can mean using less secure networks and security practices as well. But if you have an application that needs to be split tunneled, you'll be able to monitor it through Catchpoint. Thanks to our robust endpoint client and network insights module, you'll be able to pull live data from your device and determine whether or not traffic is being pushed through your VPN. This is effective whether you're checking the performance of a video application or making sure people are using the correct protocol when accessing something like financial data. Over the course of this video, we're gonna take a look at an endpoint that Catchpoint's monitoring, see what data Catchpoint pulls to provide better endpoint visibility, and then look at an application and determine whether or not it's being split tunneled. Let's hop in. Here, inside of the software, we can see an endpoint currently attached to my Catchpoint client. And I've put that information on a smart board. We can see a lot of data relevant to my device in the context of end user experience. Specifically, we can tell that our device has a decent network and application score, but I'm running into issues on the endpoint side. And here we can interpret endpoint score to mean network and device elements local to the user. Using our network insights feature, I can actually analyze my outbound connections. Taking a look at the network path, we can determine that a lot of my traffic is being pushed through a VPN, as we can see here with the Cloudflare Warp VPN underlay. If I take into Microsoft Teams, however, we can see that it's not passing through the VPN, but instead going out directly to the team's IP addresses. This is important information for me and my IT team to know in case people start reporting issues with applications like this. In this case, while the user is experiencing local network problems, it's not related to the corporate VPN that they may have installed on their device. We can go one step further in this dashboard here and actually determine how our applications are performing on various clients. You can see that I have Cloudflare Warp and Zscaler installed on the same device here, and my Microsoft Teams test used to evaluate application performance based on live user data. And in each column, you can see how Catchpoint can correctly identify endpoint client providers and distinguish between them for evaluation purposes. Here, we can determine that while the VPN clients are adding a bit of overhead in regards to application traffic, that is not hitting any alert thresholds in regards to acceptable end user experiences. This is the kind of visibility that drastically reduces day-to-day -day toil while dealing with devices in variable environments and security postures and helps prevent little issues from turning into major ones. And with that, you now know how to monitor split tunnel traffic with Catchpoint. Thanks for stopping by. I'll see you around. Sponsored by Catchpoint, the leader in digital experience management.